Welcome guys to a new future technology. Let's start. Number 1. Servo Yachts in California has teamed up with UK-based Shuttleworth Design to develop an innovative series of catamaran designs with a unique marine stabilization system. Pitching or vertical acceleration has been proven to be the main cause of seasickness, but most stabilization systems are designed to deal primarily with roll. Shuttleworth Design, the designers of the Radical 42.5 meter Tremoran Adastra, has worked closely with Servo Yachts on developing alternative technology for over eight years. During this time, several designs and mechanical arrangements have been explored and tested. The Martini 6.0 is a fast, 45 meter catamaran concept with an electro-pneumatic suspension system connecting the superstructure to two dynamic holes that can adjust over 3.5 meters to the height and angle of the waves, effectively eliminating pitch, roll, and heave. In addition, the design creates less drag than conventional fins, resulting in a more efficient and faster vessel in less than perfect conditions. Number 2. Hill sees demand for over 250 HX50 helicopters in first year of production. UK startup Hill Helicopters plans to build 260 examples of its HX50 light single in the first year of production based on current demand for the clean sheet rotorcraft. Launched in 2020, the HX50 is a turbine powered 1.65T helicopter aimed at the high end owner flyer market, which is due to enter service in 2023. Sales have been brisk, with the company claiming orders for 370 aircraft by mid-January. Although the fledgling manufacturer was initially unsure what level of demand there would be for the HX-50, it now believes that this is just going to increase, says Misha Geld, who handles sales and marketing for Hill. Consequently, output for 2024 will be ramped up over the previous year, he adds. Number 3. Aquatic Utility Vehicle, Bizarre Union of a UTV Body and Two Jet Skis We now have the world's first aquatic utility vehicle, thanks to a weird combination of a UTV cabin and two top-functioning jet skis. The audacious but awesome setup sees a UTV cabin mounted on jet skis. This weird-looking utility vehicle is named Shadow 6 Typhoon. It was developed by Shadow6, a company whose operations are streamlined to the motorsport and technology industries. Though a good number of unusual water sports toys exist, none are on the same level as Shadow6 Typhoon in its weirdness. Shadow6 Typhoon has impressive bodywork. Its body panels are obtained from a Polaris RZR. They are actually aftermarket RZR. The jet ski holes are made from carbon composite. They are aligned to long travel Fox shocks both at the front and rear. These Fox shocks are best suited for a UTV. Number 4. This luxury space balloon now has a stylish new interior. Spaceship Neptune's spherical exterior means a larger, more structurally sound interior. Plus, a splash cone helps to soften ocean landings. A space balloon that promises to carry eight guests and a swanky swingers lounge to the edge of space released its newly designed capsule today. Space Perspective said that the new capsule design of Spaceship Neptune will be safer and maximize the passenger experience by providing a roomier interior with more headroom. Number 5. This Alpine A4810 concept is powered by hydrogen. Usually students end up sketching cars out of sheer boredom, but 28 lucky so NSOS from Turin's IED Design School have been given the chance to do it for real. And on this evidence, years of practice was worth it. Learn the lesson, kids. Looks wicked, doesn't it? The Alpine A4810 concept is a two-seater berlinette with aerodynamics heavily influenced by Formula One and afternoons spent doodling through double maths. 
the students were given their brief by Alpine last autumn, and after everyone had submitted their ideas, two were chosen to form the basis of the final design. The bitone colors, matte black and carbon fiber elements have been carefully crafted to draw attention to each section of the car, while the interior was designed digitally. The Alpine A4810 project by IED has been a very exciting experience with IED students and lecturers, said Rafael Linari, Alpine's chief designer. The result is a futuristic supercar that explores new territories for the brand in terms of package, proportions, and design language. Number 6. Panther KF51. For the German tank in World War II, see. The Panther KF-51 is a main battle tank that is under development by Rainmetal Land System, part of Rainmetal's Vehicle Systems Division. It was unveiled publicly at the Eurosatory Defense Exhibition on 13 June 2022. 2. KF is short for Kittenfarzug, i.e. Track Vehicle, 3. The KF-51 is currently based on the hull of the Legacy Leopard 2A4, but the design is intended to mark a departure from the preceding generation of Western MBTs by introducing a new turret armed with an auto-loaded 130mm main gun, reducing weight through greater reliance on active rather than passive protection and facilitating teaming with uncurred platforms by providing space inside the hull for a dedicated systems operator or unit commander. Rainmetal has suggested that the KF-51 could be production ready by 2026. Number 7. Flying Superyacht by Lazzarini is now bigger, faster, and bolder, Air Yacht V2. Earlier this year, to kick off 2022 on a high note, the design studio introduced the Air Yacht, a new hybrid concept that was just what its name implied, a superyacht for the skies. Technically, the air yacht is a blimp that can also float, so while that's not the innovative part, it stands out for how luxurious it is. Or, better said, for how luxurious Lazzarini imagines it could be. You may have heard of manifesting and how it's the latest and hottest trend among celebrities and influencers. Manifesting is the practice of thinking aspirational thoughts with the goal of making them happen, of willing them into existence. In other words, if you want to be rich, you'd better start manifesting as a rich person, acting, and, more importantly, believing that you are. Actual wealth will soon follow. Lazzarini is manifesting this area. Sometime after the big online premiere of the hybrid airship, the design studio debuted the updated version, aptly called Air Yacht V2. It's bigger, it's faster, and it comes with a much sleeker and futuristic looking central hull. Whether it's better is best left for another conversation since we're still in the realm of hypothetical flying superyachts. Number 8. Electra, an all-electric foiling ferry concept revealed. Boundary Layer Technologies, a California-based marine technology startup, launched their fully electric hydrofoiling ferry concept design on October 27, 2021. Electra, twice the speed and range of existing electric ferries, has a range of up to 100 nautical miles and cruise speed of 40 knots due to Boundary Layer Technologies proprietary hydrofoil technology and pod propulsion system. Compared to fossil fuel alternatives, Electra's battery electric propulsion significantly reduces cabin noise by up to 20 dB compared to conventional ferries. Its foiling system also offers excellent sea keeping and ride comfort. Hydrofoil technology is the key to enabling electrification of passenger ferries, explains Ed Kearney, CEO of Boundary Layer Technologies. Number 9. He He's Emblem Train. The train project is an ongoing body of speculative investigation into the language and aesthetics of transport culture by artist T. They propose personal rail travel as a temporary, imaginary solution to question our industrialist conscience in relation to locomotion. As the antithesis of high-speed travel, the emblem vehicle, inspired by A.B. Clayton's painting of the inaugural journey of the Liverpool and Manchester Railway in 1830, will recreate a personal transport experience on the historic track within and the grounds of the Museum of Science and Industry in Manchester. Number 10. 
Citroen Miami Buddy debuts as Q, rugged limited production EV. The Citroen Miami Buddy concept from December 2021 is entering production in a limited run of just 50 units. The French brand is selling these special vehicles exclusively online starting June 21st. The production version of the Miami Buggy features a dark green body with a few bright yellow accents and bronze-colored steel wheels with black center caps. Rather than the concept's open sides, this variant has tubular doors. The dark gray roof has a canvas section that owners can unsnap and store behind the seats. Number 11. Future of Farming Pininfarina Design Electric Straddle Tractor for New Holland Agriculture future of vineyard farming. The famed wines flowing from regions such as Champagne, Madoc, and Burgundy are as highly prized as they are hard to grow. The vineyards are small, narrow, and often set on steep slopes, making it very hard conditions for picking, normally by hand. As a glimpse into the future, New Holland Agriculture reveals the electric straddle tractor concept, designed by Pininfarina, that masters these testing environments. Number 12. Would you take a sky cruise in a nuclear-powered flying hotel? Even with the growth in green energy, nuclear fusion still powers many facets of our lives. But, barring Cyclops and comedy classic The Big Bus, nuclear-powered vacationing has thankfully remained a largely untapped corner of the market. Until now, that is. Science communicator and video producer Hashem al has caused quite an online stir with his video spectacularly showcasing a new sky cruise concept first created by Tony Holmston, a flying hotel that can carry more than 5,000 passengers in the epitome of luxury. Thanks to its 20 nuclear-powered engines, the Skytanic, or Flytanic, take your pick as neither inspires much confidence, doesn't need to land, instead endlessly cruising above the cloud line offering spectacular sunrises and sunsets, glorious night skies and the promise of the aurora borealis up close and more extraordinary than ever. Passengers would be ferried up on conventional airliners and private jets that dock with the Sky Hotel and drop them off via an external elevator. Once on board they would enjoy luxurious living with a 360 degree viewing deck at the tail and a huge concourse with shopping malls, state of the art medical facility and all the usual trappings of a cruise ship at sea in the main body of the plane. On the tricky topic of turbulence, the Sky Hotel's AI system promises to predict in advance and use a technology similar to noise cancelling to balance out the bumps so passengers glide over the vibrations with ease particularly handy if you're taking a dip in the onboard swimming pool at the time. 